So this last winter, about halfway through the winter, I'm ashamed to say it, but we actually ran out of firewood around here. And it's an awfully easy thing to do when you have a central unit and that central unit is gonna keep you warm whether you have firewood or not. But then you get the bill and you kind of remember why you enjoyed splitting firewood so much. And on top of that, there's just something about having a good hot fire in the middle of winter that just seems to be really good for the soul. But I don't plan to ever let that happen again. And that was kind of why we made all this effort to get these logs out of the, out of the, um, the creek bottom today. So these logs are some really nice white oak logs. They came down in a hurricane about four and a half years ago. And you can see they do have some rot around the sapwood and there's some heart rot in them as well but for the most part there is a ton of really nice firewood in these logs around here white oak is probably about the best option for firewood because it burns hot it burns slow it doesn't leave a whole lot of ash gives you a really nice bed of coals and i think that these four logs plus the rounds that need to be split up 
uh, might just do us all through next winter. I'm not totally sure yet. And uh, right now we're about a month out from Easter. And the rule of thumb here is if you can get your firewood stacked and put up by Easter, uh, you're probably pretty good for next winter. And these logs will need some drying. Even though they've been down for so long, they are still pretty wet and uh, they will certainly not burn very well the way that they are. Um, I've got a few other things to do that I want to take y'all along with along on rather but first I want to give a shout out to another channel y'all have seen me do uh, food plots and stuff like that for deer hunting around here and that is one of the activities that I enjoy doing in the fall but I don't post a whole lot of deer hunting content on the channel but I have a friend whose channel is dedicated to deer hunting his name is Clay he has a channel called Out Here Outdoors and a few weeks ago uh, he asked me to uh, film the story of my favorite deer hunter, a significant deer hunt that I've had. And I did that and he posted it on his channel. And I'd love for y'all to go over there and check out his channel and maybe subscribe. Um, I'll put all his information in a pinned comment down in the comment section. Uh, head over and check him out. 